hi everyone and welcome to my channel my name is chica brown today we'll be preparing jollof fries with veggies and here are the list of ingredients spring onions ginger garlic onions uh, carrots and green beans over here we have our uh, jollof spice this is mc to be precise you can use any of it any one of your choice thyme curry salt uh, tomato paste bay leaf uh, cubes ground crayfish i love having crayfish in my jollof vegetable oil beef and fresh pepper you can decide to add fresh tomatoes but i'm cool with the tom uh, tomato paste now we'll start by blending our pepper our beef has been washed already so we'll go ahead and wash our veggies there we go scrape the carrots properly and wash your vegetables with salt this will help in inhibiting my microorganisms knowing that carrots is a tuber crop wash properly then we'll go ahead and start dicing our beef dice as small as possible or as you desire go ahead and spice our beef so now our beef is already inside the bowl we'll add our cubes this is the time you add any spice you desire to use i also add my salt A little salt, thyme, and curry. I've added curry too, and um, set it aside and allow it to sit for about fifteen to twenty minutes. Then we go ahead and dice our veggies. We also boil our rice. This water has been sitting here for some minutes. We add our washed rice. I prefer washing my rice before power boiling. Then let's check. Oh wow, it has power boiled enough. Then let's take it to the sink and strain it. Let's heat up our pots to enable it to dry. And then we add some vegetable oil. And introduce our diced onions and garlic stir fry for so for a while before introducing your diced marinated beef stir and cover the pot after about five minutes let's check the progress remember to um, steam your beef on a very low heat there we go So let's go get our blended fresh pepper. I 
allow it to steam a little this will enable the beef to absorb the pepper i actually love my rice spicy i'll transfer this um, beef to a frying pan to enable me use the pot to continue with the cooking progress because i need a small pot add your vegetable oil some pinch of salt add your crayfish this will help bring out the flavor then add your onions added our tomato paste fry it a little this is to remove the sour taste now it's time to add our steamed beef on our bell leaf please we are sorry about the change of color this is because i changed phone due to low battery add water ensure you add the quantity that will be enough to cook the rice to avoid adding extra water cover it to boil it's time to add our rice our parboiled rice rather there we go let's cover and allow it to dry up so these are our vegetables our spring onions don't forget to uh, blanch your green beans this one has already been blanched have a look then cover your pots and allow the water to dry because the vegetables will be the last thing we'll be adding as we can see it's time to add our veggies mix them properly in a bowl before adding them we have a mixture of our spring onions our carrots and green beans add and stir add little by little now our jollof rice is ready i'll be enjoying mine with a homemade zubo thank you for stopping by and sure to